All right, guys, we're back for another Dokkan Battle video, and it is time to test out how well our boy AGL Vegito is going to do the new world. Well, I mean, new. I mean, he's like a month old now, but, you know, the AGL free-to-play Vegito. How well is he going to do in Extreme Super Battle Road? This is a very good unit, this Vegito. Um, you know, just to give you guys clarity, in slot one, he gets a lot of defense. He's going to have, what? Uh, 240 percent defense in slot one and he's also going to have a 70 percent chance of dodging and he gives super class allies 30 percent attack and defense so i mean his defense at that point is going to be 270 percent we got him turn one so this is pretty good uh, we also have agl super vegeto together um okay the only thing is that super saiyan 4 goku okay we might die on this turn because again super agl is very unforgiving so, he's at 77k defense right there by himself without support, which is fine. Um, and then his defense is going to get a lot better after he attacks. And then after he attacks, he gets a 70% chance to dodge as well. Now, I did give our boy a lot of equipment. You know, I just had a bunch of spares. So, I gave him some defense, gave him some extra dodge. My Vegito, when I rainbowed him before he got his awakening, he was already at 15 dodge. So, now he's at 20. So... Um, Vegeta's attacking at the end. There's Nappa as well. Let's go for Nappa. I feel like we potentially could take Nappa down. Um, and then we should be okay for Super Saiyan 4 Goku. That is a super attack right there. All right, so let's see. Vegito will get hit very hard right here. Oh, he dodged. That's that's from the hidden potential system. A million attacks that. Not bad. But that 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 was his 20 dodge kicking in. Now, he there we go. Okay, not bad. Not bad. So his 20 dodge kicked in at the start, and then the second one was more than likely his 70% chance to dodge. Because remember, the way it works with him is he is going to get the 70% chance to dodge after he super attacks. Now, here's where things get a little bit scary, though. Goku might take a little bit too much damage right here. A double super attack would be very helpful. Okay. Um. We, yeah, we might go ahead and bow out right here. Yeah, this is why Super AGL... Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> I will take that. That's fine. <laughs> All right. That's why Extreme uh, or Super AGL Super Battle Road is just, uh, it's on a different level. We're going to go ahead and use an Android 8. I pretty much have to. Um, again, this stage is very unforgiving. I mean, that's Super Saiyan 4 Goku after he super attacks. So his defense was probably, you know, I mean, I assume the, the other one is also Rainbow. It was probably like 160K-ish, something like that. And that's the amount of damage this man was taking. Like, the stage is not for the faint of heart, right? Like, defense is not going to cut it alone. Skinny Boo has a lot of dodging, so we'll be able to rely on him. Um, I'm actually tempted to use a Princess Snake as well. I'm going to use a... Alright, so we have... Well, oh, no, 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 never mind. We used an Android 8, so Goku's defense would have been lower than that. Because I'm, I'm looking at it like, oh, he, you know, he's at 87k, so, you know, times that by 2. No, 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 the other Goku was lower. He was lower than that. Okay, okay, okay. Um, hmm. I don't know. I, I, <laughs> I might just, just test it. We're just gonna, we're just gonna rock with it and see how things go. Um, the good news is that we can get a rainbow orb here for Super Saiyan 4 Goku so he gets his defense and we can heal up a little bit more with Super Saiyan 2 Angel Goku. Uh, Super, okay. Remember, Skinny Boo has a 50% chance to dodge and 300% defense. So he is going to be able to pretty much get the job done for us rather well here. Um, that Skinny Boo is a very, very good unit for a reason, right? Like, he's he's definitely a unit we want to bring in here. So now, you know, Super AGL has gotten a few different characters um, that are really able to help out in this stage. Again, I think this base form Vegito is going to be solid. Skinny Boo, of course, is going to be fantastic as well. Um, you know, we're getting more and more. I think there's, you know, there's a new, the new Krillin. The turn of power Krillin is also, I think, going to be a pretty solid option for this stage as well. So that's good. Okay. Oh, what a bummer, man. Look at that. Oh, yeah. See, that's where this Vegito, because, okay, what we want for this Vegito to, you know, sort of like, you know, be optimal, like the sort of the optimal position for this Vegito um, is right there, but then the enemies are attacking a million times after he attacks, right? Honestly, I have to do this, or else we're, we're dead. Um, what's Vegito's defense right here is 140k. Wow. So between Pan and the Android 8, his defense is pretty good. I'm going to put Pan in slot 1. Um, we I need to keep her out of harm's way. I don't think I need to use other items. I mean, we could die right here, but 
um, we should be fine. If we die, I'll just hop right back in, right? Okay, so she's 68k right there. See, one of the big issues, though, for Super AGL um, is that Pan... I find Pan to be very weak compared to all the other 50% supports. It's another reason this stage is so hard. Notice the dip in Vegito's super attack, by the way, because he is uh, in slot 2. If he's not in slot 1, he, he's not going to get the extra attack and defense that he can get. So that, of course, will hurt him quite badly. All right, so we could definitely die right here. We got rid of Vegeta. That's good. Super Vegito. Yo, this guy is is a king in here. Look at... Dude, the damage is insane because both Pan and Vegito gave super attack buffs on their super attacks. So Super Vegito was just a, a man possessed right here. Okay, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Now we can go ahead and get out of here. Um. All right, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use an Android 8 right here because I want to go into the next fight with full health. Um, but we're not going to have the defensive buff active because we'll be able to finish off Raditz right here with the two active skills. So this is why um, I probably would consider Super Saiyan 4 Goku better for this stage than Gohan just because of this active skill right here, which, you know, frequently I think you will get this. From what I've seen, Goku and Gohan have pretty similar uh, defensive levels. Like, they both get hit hard enough to where it's an issue, right? Like, neither of them... Every other stage in the game, Goku and Gohan are great defensively. In here, not so much. They get they get slapped around. All right, so we have full health. Please do what I want. That's pretty good. Okay. So, let's see. Um, we'll keep Pan right there. All right, now the good news is that Pan... We'll go for King Cold. Pan is going to be able to get a lot of orbs. So defensively, she's going to be looking pretty good. I'm not really too concerned about the damage. Yeah, she's at 200k defense, which is very good. Uh, this Goku is also going to be able to take quite a few orbs. So I think we're in a pretty good position right here. Okay, that 20 the 20 dodge kicked in. The 20 dodge kicked in again. Woo! Let's go! There, now he's got 70% chance to dodge. You can't touch this man. Let's go. <laughs> you can't touch this man. Look at him. Go. All right. So Pan with the two-turn attack buff, by the way. And the pretty good damage by Pan. She still takes that much. Oh, my God. This stage is so unforgiving, dude. But look at Vegito, man. Hey, I'm telling you. I told people that Vegito's not that bad. All right, this is going to hurt bad, but we're not dead. Um, the uh, equipment is good. <laughs> equipment is good. It's just that simple. Okay. Phew, boy. Well, the good news is that Vegito is... We're under the HP threshold, so we can see where the super attacks are going to be. Um, I need to heal up, though. <laughs> Duh. I'm going to use a Princess Snake, and then I'm probably going to pop a Whis as well. Um, I know, you know, defensively, Vegito is going to have a little bit of an extra buff next turn, but I mean... Oh, what am I going to do? Just die? <laughs> uh, all right. That was pretty good by Vegito. I'm pretty impressed. I kind of do want to get Super Vegito back with the AGL Vegito. But, I mean, both of these guys are better in slot one. So, we're just going to rock it like that. I am going to keep Skinny Boo around, however. Because Skinny Boo is just so good. Skinny Boo is so good, right? Skinny Boo, AGL, Super Vegito. Like, this stage, Super Vegito, the thing about him, right, is, you know, he can be really risky in slot one. You know, sometimes his damage isn't the greatest. He is so custom designed for this stage. It's not even funny because the enemies are very squishy. I've complained many times that the problem with some of these Vegito counter units nowadays is that bosses actually are tanky enough now where if you don't get crits, you're not doing a lot of damage with these counters. In this stage, the enemies are squishy, so Vegito does not have that problem whatsoever. He dominates in here, right? And then on top of that, they hit so hard that he is, like, the only one that could take double digits from these guys. Like, so, it's just, like, this Vegito, like, he is so far and away a king in this stage. And it's by far and away the hardest stage in the game, too, that it really helps him out a lot. All right. So, we have a lot of damage reduction on this turn. So, let's not really go too crazy. Oh, Vegito's only taking so much damage, right? It doesn't really matter right here. Um, uh, if he dodges, though, that's sick. Give us some more dodges. Okay, he got hit right there. Again, don't worry about the damage because we have damage reduction items active. That's not really relevant. Um, and then... Oh, double super attacks. That's an attack buff for the turn. So now Super Saiyan 4 Goku is going to look better. This guy's good. Uh, there's the dodge. 70% chance of dodge. Man, listen. This Vegito is good. People were telling me, Oh, he's he's okay. He's not... Oh, there's better units to use for Super AGL. Extreme Super Battle Road. Okay. Sure. G go ahead and point him out for me, buddy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Come into this... 
this hell house, this massacre stage right here. Show me all the units that are 500 times better than that AGL Vegito right there, because there ain't a lot. <laughs> you know, it's, uh, the stage is not for the faint of heart, right? And if you don't exactly have, you know, UI, LR UI Goku or STR Whis or Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta on Super AGL, the way you do it for Super STR, so. Um, this is pretty bad. We're probably dead. I'm gonna use... I'm gonna use a Nurse Chi-Chi just so we can get at least one more turn. That was a mistake. Uh, I'm gonna use a Princess Tank, because I don't know what I was thinking. I, I only needed to use... Uh, well, well... Nah, I did need to use both, actually. Alright, and then next turn, we'll be at full health and we can test out AGL Vegito again. Um... All right, so we'll do this. We'll lose a little bit of attack for Vegeta. Or, Veg excuse me, Vegito. Uh, not really a big deal, though. We're going to go for Cooler, because Cooler, of course, is the big dog right here. Um, and then this Super Saiyan 2 Goku, getting him a ton of orbs like that is beautiful. I didn't need to use the Princess Snake, damn it, because he would heal us up with all that um, HP. You know, I might look into giving that Goku the, um, like, HP regeneration buff uh, equipment. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to point it out real quick. I don't know if I have any equipment on him, right? I've just been doing chain battles, but I haven't really been, go like, detailed going through a lot of these units to see. Look how good this Vegito is in here, dude. Like, he is so good in this stage. Like, it's insane. But, um, like, I haven't, like, gone through, like, every unit and, like, tried all these different, like, equipment options I've got from chain battle. I'm sort of just, like, being hesitant with it. Um, you know, they're giving us so much equipment in so many different stages. Okay. That's a little bit unfortunate right there that Cooler got stunned. Only because I'd much rather Vegito have to take the full brunt of damage and stuff like that on this turn, but it's okay. Um, yeah, because both, yeah, it sucks. Both of the attacks after him are from Cooler. Um, okay, well, the good news is that we have a lot of orbs right here, so we don't have to worry about items. I mean, we're probably going to die anyway, because this stage is super tough, but see how things go. Oh, wait, wait, let me, uh, this go, do I have equipment on him? No, okay. So I want to get this one right here, the little Goku face one. I would love, because that increases the amount of healing you get from same type orbs. So for this Goku, AGL orbs, but then he also gets this massive 10,000 HP per orb. Then he's also double healing from AGL orbs. And then if we gave him this and his defense, can I click it please? Then his defense is increasing as he gets orbs, so his healing is just off the charts at that point. Right, so I definitely am probably going to give the, those little Goku head symbols to him. All right, that sucks. That's not good. Yeah, th this is where... Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, we saw the good and the bad from him, right? That can happen in slot one. That that would be the same. AGL... Okay, Super Saiyan Vegito would have been killed right there as well, by the way. It's not like... See, that's the thing. People will suck Super Vegito's dick all day long, right? All day long. He would have gotten killed right there the exact same way that base Vegito did. It wouldn't have been any different because the very first attack that came in was a super attack, which is this guy's weakness. So there was literally no difference between which Vegito we had in that slot right there. They both would have been killed. That's both the weak. It's, it's unfortunate they have the same weakness, which is that the very first hit can demolish them. Well, I mean, this guy, if he doesn't get hit before he goes, he's like going to be, you know, Mr. Fantastic. But, you know, he could take a lot of damage if he gets hit beforehand. I mean, that was not bad. Again, we saw good and bad from him right there. I, I thought he did rather well. He had many, many dodges. The 20 dodge I gave this man actually kicked in quite a few times as well. So a unit like this, dodge is good. What about, I'm curious, my AGL Khalifa, what is my girl at? Oh, she's at 23 dodge. I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Because all I do is I get these stupid dodge equips nonstop. So like, I might as well put them to use, right? So let me know what you guys thought of uh, Vegito. I mean... I'm just going to tell y'all right now, I was pretty impressed. This is a world tournament free-to-play unit. And again, you know, he's not doing the damage that Super Vegito is, but he was he was doing a lot of dodging, a lot of bobbing and weaving. He's good. And he was increasing the damage for the rest of the rotation with his super attacks. Um, this AGL-based Vegito is very strong for just a free-to-play world tournament unit. So, shout-outs to him. Uh, thanks, guys, for watching, and I'll catch y'all next time.